Hello and thanks for joining. In this short video, we're just going to look at how you can set host names on your uh, Linux servers. So these are essentially three different ways you can do that. That's very simple and uh, straightforward pretty much. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe and turn on your notification for similar content. So. Uh, all you need is just access to your terminal. You can open your terminal on any distribution of um, uh, Linux you have. So the one I have is Rocky Linux. Uh, this works on most uh, Linux distributions. So first, just check your host name. The host name I have set for this is uh, test2.com. The testing. So we can uh, change that first method is using the hostname ctl uh, command and you just give the option set hostname so hostname ctl set hostname so we can call this first uh, host uh, dot com anything so if you now do hostname you can see the hostname has changed the second method is using nmcli so nmcli you give the option general, then uh, general host name. Uh, then we say second host.com. We're changing it now. So if you say host name, you can see the host name has changed. The third option is using NM, uh, the text user interface, NMTUI. And you can see this um, set host name, set system host name. Hit enter. And we can change this to say dot host. Uh, .com. Uh, remember, you need root access to be able to do this, either root or or sudo access permission to do this. So uh, say OK. If we check the host name now, uh, it's that host.com. And uh, that's essentially it. Host name CTL just to add hostname ctl gives you more um, sort of uh, information about the uh, operating system but essentially the hostname you can see that's the hostname uh, things like the type of machine i'm currently running this on a vm uh, the os that is running rocky linux virtualization came with things like that the architecture of the cpu that i have currently so yeah, so we can change that as well to any other hosting we want. So that's uh, basically it. It's easy and straightforward. I would like to thank you for watching this. And if you've got any question, please drop a comment. Uh, do make sure to subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.